hello there everyone who's watching on YouTube. Thank you for uh, showing up on this episode as well. Now, Waldenhof Dieter is over there with some units. Could recruit some more zombies, but I'm gonna try to avoid zombies from now on. Uh, what I really want... Okay, so I think I can capture that, but I don't think I can actually keep it afterwards. Well, Waldenhof is fine. So here's what I'm gonna do. I can't recruit units, but if I capture the place, I can. What does Eschen have? Yeah, nothing too interesting. Yes, yeah, so I can just auto-resolve this one, capture it, there we go, loot and occupy for sure, I do get the money, so that means that I have money for a lot of stuff, okay, he wants me to go to the Battle of Hell Fan, that will give me a necromancer and the gold sigil sword, that's a common one, come on, where is it, there, it has some Osterlan expedition. Interesting. That's some heavy units there. I mean, I'll need some spearmen to deal with the guard. I need some flying units to go against the hand gunners and crossbowmen. Then I need anything that I can to deal with Hans Helmut and his halberdiers and swords. Alright, I can overcome that with a lot of units. Blood, blood with specifically the Blood Knights, these guys are just gonna do a lot of damage there. Okay, so. Plan. Can't recruit anything interesting there. Oh, but I can recruit these guys. So let me see what can I do. So this is repair 640, 410. Can actually demolish that one. 410, that's a thousand. This guy, if he recruits, that is a thousand and six hundred. That means no more buildings for now. Which I cannot do it. Uh, Either way, so I guess that's cool. Let's go for it. So, repair, repair. You're going to get something else. Let's go for skills. Always like the campaign movement range. Let's go with this. It's cool. Cannot recruit anything here, but I can recruit something here if I want. Which I kinda do. Can I recruit any heroes? Nah, not yet, of course. Now, let's go for it. Might as well recruit some skeleton warriors. There we go. And this guy is just going to take Fort Oversteer and capture it. Yeah, there we go. Now I can loot and occupy. That is always good. We got the Pigeon Plucker Pendant. That's real, not really good. Oh well. Okay, I can demolish this building. I really don't want it there. I don't need it, to be truthful. Oh god! That's good. That just gives me so much experience. I mean, that's awesome. I should go against this guy very soon, but for now it's totally fine. Yeah, there we go. What can I raise? Not can I can't raise anything interesting. Just zombies. Really don't want to raise zombies for now. So yeah, let's go for the next turn. And I'll join both of my armies to get over Waldenhof and thus finishing this uh, faction. That'll be nice. Then I can just stack up. They want me to break the non-aggression pact with him? No, decline. I don't want that. Now is not the time. They want a peace treaty and pay me for it. I could get into the peace treaty and then just betray them. But the reliability is really important in the early game, so not gonna not gonna fall for it. Your prestige grows. Did got this. You know, the capture. Your conquest spreads far and wide. The objectives Your there. Developing path no, I need the spread of undeath. Distant of kings and best. Right, so. What is the chapter objective so far? Complete one quest chains. That's good. That'll be just the Battle of Hellfan and other ones. Eight of the following missions, okay. Be at war with five factions, I really don't want. 25% of these provinces of Overland, Ostermark. It's interesting that he wants me on Ostermark. Everland, Zufbar. Zufbar is going to be difficult, but oh well. And carry out a successful victory attempt. Okay, that is fine. That is fine. Now, 
what can I build here? What is actually my goal here? I wanted the defiled camp there. I want to build this up on the corrupted village. Do I? Or do I want to build something extra here? Okay, so this one, for sure, I might as well just get growth going. And Eshen, yeah, for sure, let's build that up. I know that he might have some zombies there, but it's it's kind of okay. Yeah, what can I recruit here? Not, not a lot of stuff. Can recruit some direwolves. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go here. Recruit some direwolves. Like two of them is going to be awesome. And a, fi a fell bat. That is cool. Actually, instead of the fell bats... Well, I can recruit the fell bats in the next turn. I can actually recruit these regiments of renown. I can raise a skeleton spearman, which is awesome. Okay, so if I siege... Walden Half actually has a garrison, so yeah, if I siege, he'll attack me. So minus 2, minus 10. Yeah, there's no problem. I'm gonna raise the public order very soon, so that's okay. Having the charnel pit there in Western Sylvania. Yeah, this feel like it was on my ideas, so yeah, let's go for it. So far, Eshen is going well and needed the the cemetery here. I also want the tangled vine patch. You know, it is just mostly for the public order for now. And then I'll get the garrison, or maybe I can get it later on. You know, still produces some vine. Okay, end of the turn. So Waldenhof probably will try to, try to attack very soon, or just build up a massive army. Oh. Oh. They're paying me a lot, actually, but, you know, don't want to do that because I want to finish them out. You know, I wish I could confederate or something. They haven't grown, and they have a lot of dire wolves. What happens here? Got some public, uh, some population surplus. This one needs three turns. It's okay. It's okay. Might as well just recruit the regiments right now. Recruit them. So there is 19 out of 20. I'm gonna attack there and this guy is just gonna go here as well. Faction encountered the red eye. Might as well just try to get some trade going. We want trade. They don't want that. A minion of Von Kasta. No. Talk at me These guys also don't want anything. Okay, that's cool. Man, these earplugs, these e e this headset is just doing a lot of pressure on my. I head. want their souls. Okay, so th he doesn't have any walls here. He does have these crypt horrors, so that's dangerous. I can just send my blood knights against them. Yeah, pretty sure I could just send my blood knights against them. Yeah, can fight this out pretty easily. So what does he have here? Five direwolves, six, seven direwolves? That's a lot, actually. Seven direwolves. How many spearmen do I have? I have four. Well, might as well sacrifice some zombies there. Yeah. Well, he does have like six units of zombies, so those do not matter. And even the direwolves, I mean, they're not, they're gonna suffer a lot, so might as well do this battle. That will end probably all my zombies and skeletons, so that I can get better units. Uh, I would much likely get some, some grave guards very soon, so, you know, that's the purpose. I need an armory as fast as possible. I actually went for the Sinister Corpse, I shouldn't. I should have gone, you know, the building, uh, sorry, not the Sinister Corpse, the Defiled Cairn. I should have gone immediately for the armory there. But, you know, with the money that I'm going to get from this, uh, maybe I can expend that on, on it. So far, the Blood Knights, you know, those are the guys who, who will give me the, the stuff here. So I'm going to set up a lot of my initial 
the force with just the zombies ahead. That seems to be the best course of action here. They're completely expendable. And they're not bad units per se, you know? It's, it's like peasants on Medieval 2. They still do their role, but these guys don't rout immediately, you know? Okay, so I do have the Vanguard, but on this case I'm not going to take advantage of it. You know, might as well get my Direwolves and Blood Knights on one flank, though. And that is good. Might as well get these guys on this flank. But my reinforcements are coming in from that, uh, that side, so might as well control this flank properly. Yeah, there we go. These guys can... This way, this flank can deal a lot of damage. Now, then I'm just going to wait with my zombies in the middle. I can gamble a little bit. That may be a lot... Okay, that is okay. Gambling never pays. You know, gambling never pays. So I want the Konig Stalkers here. What are they called? Konig Stain Stalkers. These guys, they're going to defend the left flank. Vlad, we can go here. So start the battle. Now he has a lot of die wolves there. But my reinforcements are arriving. Which means this guy as well. These skeletons, let's just join them with this group. Let's just move here. Zombies. Actually, group 4, let's just go back. I mean, it's better to do this to make sure that the other reinforcements arrive because they're so slow. I mean, look at this. The zombies are so slow. Might as well wait for them, right? There we go. Yeah, I think this side will control the that flank. I mean, he only has one direwolf there, so I mean, maybe this side can just have some extra units there. There we go. These zombies join up. Yeah, the line of zombies is just going to push forward. Now, where is his... There's the Crypt Horrors. I need to go... I need to control the, the main line to make sure that the die. Group 5, I want you to control the the area here. These are the anti-large units, so, you know, got to make sure that I control them properly. These guys got to go here. The flood, you can go here. You can go over there. Yeah, lots of direwolves here. I'm going to try and send these spearmen again against them. There's some felbats and felbats and felbats. There's some skeleton spearmen and skeleton spearmen. He actually deployed perfectly there. I mean, if I would move the, all of this to that other side and just get all my spearmen there, that could also work out. But I'm pretty sure that he would move away. So let me just get everyone together and see if he will charge my flanks or something, you know. Okay, increase the power reserves, that is nice. Yeah, I mean, he's already moving a couple of direwolves to that spot, which is good. So might as well just move these guys ahead. There we go. Group 1. And group 2. Yeah. There we go. Group 6, you can cover them, so that'll be it. Group 3, you're the ones we need to engage properly, so let's just go over there. Group 4, it kind of looked like he said that. There we go, these guys can just move like this. And Vlad can go over here. You can go over here, there we go. Let's speed it up. I know these battles aren't as epic. But hopefully these guys with the poison attacks that they have, hopefully they're going to do really well. This guy doesn't have poison attacks, do they? No, they don't. What do they have differently? Oh, it's the hit points. They actually have something else. 
You have some physical resistance, so these guys can survive for a lot longer. Yeah, that's the deal there. Zombies are so slow. I mean, they're already going as fast as they can. You know, just telling zombies to attack is just so much time. I'm getting sick. Just, you know, I think it's the undead here. And what is that smell? Oh, it's just the troops. <laughs> Do you know the quote? <laughs> That's a quote from... from Warcraft 3, actually. Beautiful one. <laughs> oh, what's that smell? Oh, it's just the troops. <laughs> Okay, three direwolves, yeah, I'm pretty sure that these guys can hang out my hand on it. I mean, I also have the cutting stain stalkers here. Pretty sure that those these guys will just do a lot of damage, these crypt goals. They'll still die, of course. Those are just zombies. Alright, hang out a second, guys. Sorry about that. While we wait that the zombies arrive, come on, have so many zombies. These guys are just gonna wreck them. They're nearly there, but it's okay. Let's go, group six. You're gonna keep them covered. Group three and group four. You're just gonna move in. You know, like that. There we go. We're just gonna move in as well, like that. There we go. Actually, don't. Just apply here. Failing a little bit with this cold today. Yeah, I really want to take over those guys, you know, I'm, I'm being ca extra careful. Because those are direwolves, they can still charge into a lot of damage to my own, you know. So over here I cannot control the charges. I can just make sure that I don't get too surrounded. I mean, these guys are good against everything that they have. These guys are terrible. These guys are kind of, kind of cool. I mean, let's go. They only have to deal with those. I mean, can these guys handle those? Yeah, they can handle. So the conics thing are really good against them. So that's that's the deal there. I'm gonna send them in. Okay. Group three, let's move in. Group four, let's move in. Pretty sure that he will attack me afterwards. Vlad and the crypt ghoul. I, I kinda wanna deal with his Units first. If I can deal with the flanks, it's so good. And let's do that right away. I mean, Felbats. Let's just deal with the Die Wolves there and let's just send these guys in. There we go. Let's kill them all. Group 6, they're doing fine. These guys can just go over there. These guys can cover. Go over there. Get them, get them. Where's his general? There we go. Get the fell bats there. There we go. This skeleton streamer, they're gonna try there. Let's go against the crypt horrors there. There we go. 
Okay, so where is my dude? Let's give these guys less power. Let's cure these zombies. Not those skeleton warriors, but it's okay. Okay, time for my cavalry to move in. There we go. These guys are all engaged. These are zombies and skeleton spearmen. Zombies can deal with these guys. Blood Knights, let's attack on their backs. This guy, you're just gonna send against these Cryptoros. There we go. Everything seems to be fine here. These guys are actually not fine at all. I mean, he's winning because, you know, units. Right. Die wolves, let's attack there. These die wolves, let's get away. There we go. Where's the blood knights? There they can go. The far guys are doing quite strongly against them. I mean, it's cool. These guys are killing the critical binded ones. That is cool. Let me make sure that I keep the conic thing alive. And the teeth. There we go. These guys, let's get the blood knights. There we go. These guys, where can I go? Oh, they can attack there. Okay, so everything here on this flank seems to be going fine. Fell bats, you can certainly attack that Dieter. There we go. There we go, let's go for Dieter there. Everyone here is okay. Where is my... Var guys, they've dealt with the Crypt Horrors, so let's just deal with these guys. Let's get away. Where are my Blood Knights? Come over here. There we go. Come on, Von Karstein, what can you do? Well, that guy is nearly dead. Let me just make sure that none of my special forces dies. These guys, for instance. Let's attack those zombies. Actually, not the zombies. I mean, these guys are doing great, but they're gonna die there. There we go. Let's just move there. These blood knights, they've done their work. Let's attack here. There we go, they've done a lot of damage there, that's cool. So where is his general? I mean, this flank is doing great. Where's my friend? Hello there, dudes. So let's get this guy out of their money, shall we? There we go. Make sure that the teeth survives, or the teeth, eh? And let's attack on that side. Yeah, it's done because, you know, most of their their lord is dead and most of the units are going to crumble. So that was a good victory. Finally. <laughs> good. Maybe I can get some good raised deads here. Wow, I had a unit of zombies getting 75 kills. Man, those aren't slow zombies. I did have these guys, you know, hanging on to until they were dead. If that could be said, <laughs> you know. That was nice. So I could subjugate, but no, I want to occupy on this case. There's too many hey, issues with the public order already. So Temple Hawk is dead. Province secured. There's 
Nice. So I have the Sinister Corpse, which will be destroyed. And what do I have here yet? Okay, so I can merge. That is nice. Can't raise anything interesting. I can get these guys. Uh, and what I can do as well is give him important units. I can get him, get him some zombies, or I mean, I can get them away. Let's just do like this. Let me check. These guys, can they merge? The world they can. So I can exchange one unit of these with one unit of these. There we go. You can merge all of your units. There we go. Go and now you could attack the Battle of Helmer. Yeah, it seems like I have the right units for it. Could also raise some dead. Interesting. Could recruit these regiments, but I want to take over the money so that I can get extra stuff. So Templehof is dead. This guy can't recruit anything interesting. Could recruit some dudes there, but I don't know. Welcome to my so let's upgrade this guy. Yeah, not really gonna have that. Skill points. There we go. Call of Horror. That helps. Speed plus 15%. That is awesome. That helps a lot, guys. So for YouTube, that'll be it. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next episode. For the stream, stay right there. I'm going to keep up with the streaming session for a couple of hours. So cheers, guys, on YouTube. Bye-bye.